For as long as she can remember, Nechez Hansen has been a little different physically. When I was growing up, I always kind of walked a little goofy, and I would run, and I would fall, but I'd get right back up and start running again. Seven years ago, she was diagnosed with the neurodegenerative disease Friedrich's ataxia. I just cried because it was scary. A lot of people died being really young. and I was only 17. But Hansen sought treatment at the USF Ataxia Research Center. Right now, there is no cure or no treatment for Friedrich's ataxia, either by the FDA or any other treatment. So that's what our research center is working on now, along with Friedrich's Ataxia Research Alliance. That could come in the form of Epi-743, a drug that's the focus of a national clinical trial led by USF. Like an antioxidant, but an extremely strong antioxidant, much stronger than the CoQ10 or vitamin E that you see in your drugstore, for example. While Hansen doesn't know if she's receiving the drug or a placebo... I kind of feel like I'm the same. But people tell me that I'm standing better, I'm walking better, I sound better. But no matter what happens, thanks to the help she's gotten at USF, this Polk County math teacher won't slow down. So I always say either you laugh about it or you cry about it, and I'm done crying. The USF Ataxia Research Center and the Friedrichs Ataxia Research Alliance are holding a public symposium September 5th and a fundraising gala September 7th, both in Tampa. For University Beat, I'm Mark Schreiner. To find out more about the study and these upcoming events, log on to WUSF.org and click on the University Beat link.